Well, it doesn't get any more better than this. Tommy Sunshine, welcome to Amsterdam Dance Event. <laughs> it doesn't get any better than this? One, that's wonderful, thank you. <laughs> you've, uh, you've got a very good reputation around, around the Amsterdam Dance Event and indeed the, the industry in itself. Uh, how, do you, uh, how do you cope with that reputation? What do, you, uh, what do you strive for when you come here? You know, I, I just I just think about all of all of the the aspiring producers and the and the young kids that come here, and they they really don't know what they want to do in this business, and I hope that I'm one of the people that that they look to and they say, oh okay, so you don't have to be a sucker, you don't have to do what other people tell you to do, you don't have to like there is no like path that you're supposed to. To follow, you know, you can be your own person, and you can be an individual in this in this in this music, and you can just do the things that you want to do. I mean, it might not make you rich, and Lord knows I'm not, but like, you know, I do have an amazing artistic career, and I've never compromised. I've never done anything I didn't want to do, and if I can if I can stand as that guy to these kids and to anyone else in this industry, I mean, I'm okay with that. So what's steered you over the years? What's, what's driven you? What's uh, given you inspiration? I'm a very lucky person. I, I, I grew up in Chicago in the 80s, and I got to see house music give birth to, to a culture, really. I mean, it was, it was amazing. And being a part of that, you know, you would think I'd be a purist, you know? Like, yeah. most of the people that came from, you know, the scene that I was in are very you know, snotty about house music, you know? It's like, it has to be a very certain way, and if it's not that, then it's not real. I'm the opposite of that. I mean, I, I think that, you know, everything that's evolved out of house music is a wonderful thing, and whether that's Larry Heard or LMFAO, it's all good. Like, if it, you know, as long as it came from that place, then we're still a lot better off than going to see Nine Inch Nails. Like I would, I would much rather see somebody who came from this music and evolved out of this music than from anywhere else. I saw, I heard you uh, say mention earlier that you've got a lot of unsigned tracks and you've got a lot of meetings. So how are those meetings going so far for you? Amazing. I mean, it's it's kind of funny because you know, as professional as we all try to be. The nights get long and you know the early meetings don't usually happen and you have to scramble to make them work before the end of the day but you know it, it, it's a bit funny but you know we're all loose people you know what i mean like it's it's this is this isn't exactly like a dental convention like we're all like music people so it it is a little uh, it's a little rough around the edges but we all make it work and you always end up seeing who you need to see before it's over so the program, uh, the evening program, the festival events themselves, is there, is there any, have you picked out any specific events that you want to try and track and follow? I went last night to see Sebastian play live, the Ed Banger guy, and that was, that was a sight to see. It was, uh, it, he's live now, and it's, it's, it's pretty awesome. Like, I mean, you know, and, and it's just nice to see people evolve, you know what I mean? Like, to go from just spinning records to, like, putting on, like, a proper live show, but that's, that's a good one. Um, and I was excited about that. I'm excited to play tonight. I'm playing the Secure and House of Sounds showcase. So me and Barpy Moore and Ty and Riptide and Harvard Bass are all playing at this you know kind of tiny club here in Holland. So that's going to be really good. And I'm, I'm I'm really looking forward to Dave Clark's party too. He's he's got Andy Weatherall who produced Screamadelica, which is more or less my favorite record of all time so he's going to be playing and daniel miller from mute records right. and i mean it's bananas like it's you know epic techno people like epic people in the lineage of electronic music like i mean dave's a god so wow well listen tommy sunshine you're the nicest guy at amsterdam <laughs> in amsterdam it's official yes tommy sunshine <laughs>